Hello, this is Furry Murray 7 and in celebration of Dark Souls 2, I am giving away two Amazon.com uh, gift cards for $5 each. I'm giving away $10 worth of gift cards. And uh, listen, stay listening on how you can uh, get uh, the details on how to be eligible to win that. I haven't had a sweepstakes in quite a while. But first, <clears throat> I wanted to talk to you about Dark Souls and Dark Souls 2. Um, honestly, I haven't really been keeping up that much with the information <laughs> on what Dark Souls 2 is, is supposed to be. Uh, <clears throat> just so you know, Dark Souls 2 will be released on March 11th. Okay, March 11th. Remember that date. That's the day when Dark Souls 2 will be released. I have already pre-ordered the game uh, from Amazon. <clears throat> and... Uh, so I'm going to be able to post videos right on the day of the release date. So, just so you know that. Um, Dark Souls 2, I've heard some promising things about Dark Souls 2. A lot of good things. Um, the game is supposed to be hard. <laughs> just like just like the original Dark Souls, it's supposed to be hard. Hard to play. And uh, <clears throat> um, My answer to that is, I, you know... I, after you've been playing Dark Souls for a while, like I have, you learn that it's not that hard if you just learn that you can't just run out and, and dash out into the middle of things. <laughs> this isn't Call of Duty. I mean, this is a completely different genre of, of gameplay, and the way you win in this game is not to go dashing, you know, through the snow in a one horse open sleigh. You have to... You have to... <laughs> Be careful and and check your surroundings and all of that stuff. And you know, if you do that, <clears throat> the game shouldn't be that hard. I mean, uh, the only people, um, you know, the only time um, I've really had big trouble with this game is when I was trying to just run through without without thinking first. You have to think, uh, but. <laughs> Dark Souls 2. <clears throat> I wanted to talk about some of the things that Dark Souls 2 because I haven't really seen very many people talk about all the spell casting options in Dark Souls 2. This is the problem. Everybody keeps focusing on melee fighting and nobody ever pays attention to spell casting. So, I'm going to <laughs> I'm going to do that. So, <clears throat> um spells in this game are going to have levels. <clears throat> so, you won't have a whole bunch of soul arrows like you did in Dark Souls. Like you had like eight different types of soul arrows. <laughs> Taking up all your attunement slots. You got your normal soul level. And then you got your normal soul level that does more damage. Then you got a soul arrow that does more damage but it takes longer. And then you got... <laughs> no, you're not going to have that in Dark Souls 2. Dark Souls 2, your spells are going to have levels. <clears throat> So hopefully this was so that you got you, you at level one I guess is the normal soul arrow, but then once you get that to level two, it'll do more damage and and stuff like that. That way I suppose you can conserve space in your attunement slot category, which I kind of like. Um, that sounds pretty cool. But that way I can have more room for other stuff instead of having instead of needing to have you know two or three different types of soul arrows attuned at the same time. I can just have one soul arrow attuned. And that'll be enough to last me the whole, the whole, the whole thing. Um, or it should be enough to last me the whole thing. As long as they give us enough casts. Um. <laughs> um, I'll be fine with it. Um, fireballs. <clears throat> fireballs. <clears throat> when you use fireball, the explosion will hurt you. You will be able to hurt yourself with fireballs. Um, I, I, I guess that kind of makes sense. And I was actually kind of thinking about that I was, as I was playing Dark Souls. It's like the fire is like really hot, right? So why doesn't it hurt me? Yeah. <laughs> I guess because I'm the one that cast it. So the fire likes me, but it doesn't like everyone else. But uh, no, Dark Souls 2 fireballs are going to be able to hurt anyone and everyone, including you and your teammates. <clears throat> Which makes sense when you think about it. But, uh, no, but, uh, <clears throat> I enjoy it. In case you're wondering what's going to happen, I am going to make videos. I probably will make another beginner guide to, uh, uh, for Dark Souls 2, kind of like my first one. If you don't know already, I made a beginner sorcerer guide for Dark Souls. It's a beginner guide on spellcasting, and, uh, it's not just for beginners. I mean, it's for everybody. I consider it the perfect guide, because it, it has, it's, it's a guide 
for twinking, but you don't have to be a twink in order to follow the guide. You can enjoy that guide even if you're just a normal spellcaster with 25 int, as a <laughs> one commenter told me. But, <clears throat> um, I probably will make that for Dark Souls 2. In case you're wondering, I, uh, I do plan on spellcasting in <laughs> Dark Souls 2. I love it. Not enough people are doing it. And every time I go on YouTube and look up Dark Souls, it's always some melee fighter. Where, you know... <laughs> they always completely forget about spellcasting, but... But, um... But not me. Um... Um, Dark Souls. Dark Souls 1. Um, after Dark Souls 2 comes out, I probably won't make any Dark Souls 1 videos, except... What I really, really wanted to do for a while... Is make a lore video for Dark Souls. I, um... Uh, I wanted to make a lore video because some of the... Uh, I have watched some other lore videos from some other YouTubers, but they didn't really. I, I've been I've searched for what I wanted them to talk about, <laughs> and then talk about it. I wanted I wanted to cover more of the um, <coughs> my <coughs> findings and speculations as to kind of the uh, the spellcasting aspect. <laughs> Of uh, some of the lore because it's really it's really really interesting when you uh, when you get into it. Uh, I'm not just being biased because I like spellcasting, <laughs> but um, I, I haven't I haven't got the chance to make it and I want to make it before Dark Souls 2 come out before because I'm afraid that if I wait until after Dark Souls 2 comes out, then it'll be too late to make any Dark Souls videos, including a lore video, but uh, I wanted, I've, I've wanted to do that. I really, really want to do a lore video. It's going to take a while, though. Um, good videos always take a long time to make, <laughs> but uh, but I'm really going to try to do that, but I'm already kind of, my schedule's already kind of backed up as it is. I mean, I still got this Fable Anniversary thing. Uh, more Fable Anniversary videos I want to make. There's still a couple of more Halo Wars videos I want to make. I mean, uh, there's still... Um, a lot of videos that I've been planning on doing, but I've been procrastinating. <laughs> and I haven't done it yet, but... I... Eventually, I'll, I'll find the time to do all of this. But, uh, in the meantime... <clears throat> what you guys need to do is you need to pre-order Dark Souls 2. You can get it from Amazon... Uh, dot com. That's why I order all my stuff. I'm a member of Amazon Prime, by the way, so I get f shipping for free. But... <clears throat> to help speed along, along the process... Of uh, getting Dark Souls, I am offering two five-dollar Amazon.com gift cards, and the way you <clears throat> can be eligible to win them is you have to do two things. First, you have to subscribe or already be subscribed, and uh, two, you need to leave a comment on this video. Leave a, if you can do those two things, subscribe and leave a comment, then you will be eligible to win. Uh, the sweepstakes. Now, I'm only going to be running the sweepstakes from now until March 11th of 2014. So if you're watching this video after March 11th, don't worry because I'll be doing more sweepstakes in the future. I'm kind of infamous for doing sweepstakes, giving out a whole bunch of free stuff. So, <clears throat> here is the information on what's going to happen if you manage to win. And, uh, thank you very much for watching and make sure that you please like and subscribe. If you win the Amazon.com gift card, I will send you a private message on YouTube telling the you that you won, and then you will have up to three days to reply to my email. If you do not reply to my message within three days, I'm just going to offer the prize to somebody else. But after you reply, I'm going to send you another message, and I will give you a code that you will use to... Uh, redeem your gift card on Amazon.com. So what you will have to do is you'll have to go to the Amazon.com website. You'll go to Amazon.com slash GC. And once you do that, it will take you to the Amazon gift card page on their website. You'll click the Redeem Now button uh, on the left hand side you'll go through the steps and it will eventually take you to this page where you can type in the code that I gave you into the box you'll click the redeem button and it will automatically redeem your gift card and you'll be able to use it on any purchase on amazon.com